the silver tsunami is coming, the silver tsunami is coming, the silver tsunami video is coming right up. <laughs> Welcome, I am glad you're back. If this is your first time visiting, my name is Andy Elliott. I work with the Selms Real Estate here in Williamson County, Tennessee, and we serve the Nashville area. Remember to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell to be notified of new videos as they come along. People born between the years 1946 and 1964 are called baby boomers. You probably knew that. Maybe what you didn't know is there's 74 million of us in the United States, and yes, I am a boomer. What else you might not know is there's 128 million homes in the United States, 75% of baby boomers own homes. In fact, we own 30% of the homes in the U.S. That's 38 million homes. Why am I telling you this? Well, baby boomers are getting older, and we own a lot of homes. And as nature takes its course, more homes will become available. Enter the Silver Tsunami. Yes, 38 million homes may be coming to the market in the next couple of decades, but it's gonna be a slow, steady roll. From 2007 to 2019, boomers released 730,000 homes per year. But as a group, as time marches on, those numbers will rise. And in the next 10 years, they're expected to release 930,000 homes per year. And after that, 1.2 million. Part of the reason for this gradual process is this. With medical advances being what they are today, people are simply living longer. And with the cost of assisted living and retirement homes being so high, I read between six and eight thousand dollars a month dependent on services, and I'm sure you could find higher. The older generation is aging in place. That's actually a thing. You can Google that. What it means is the older generation is staying in the family home as long as possible, understandably trying to keep expenses down, but at the same time it keeps inventories low. Here's an interesting side note. What would you guess is one of the fastest growing industries in the United States? What are 24-hour home care services, Alex? Freddie Mac revealed the aging in place dynamic is keeping 1.6 million homes off the market, creating what the Chicago Tribune called a near gridlock in the marketplace. I think it's possibly overstating it, but it does have a throttling effect. According to Zillow Research, the houses released during the coming silver tsunami will provide a substantial and sustained boost to the economy, comparable to the new construction boom of the 2000s. Think about it. Since 2013, we've sold between five and five and a half million homes per year in the U.S. Add another half a million homes to that number and business is good for everybody. Although the effects will be significant and all areas will feel it to some degree, it won't happen fast and not in all markets equally. Retirement hubs like Florida, Arizona, and surprisingly New York City will feel the impact the greatest. Metro magnets like Atlanta, Austin and Dallas, they'll feel it less. But the economy on the whole, very healthy, ironically. So again, why am I telling you this stuff? Real estate's important to the American economy and the baby boomer silver tsunami effect, that's inevitable. And I just thought you might like to know. I hope you liked watching this video as much as I did making it. Remember to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell to be notified of new videos as they come along. Leave a comment and give me a like, will you? Talk to you soon.